The song is called Starry Eyed, so I have chosen this particular image because she's using physical stars on her hands to emphasise the nature of the song. Ellie Golding is a unique artist and the record company want to portray her as different to other female artists. So this is done through the special effects like the appearance of her floating. A classic convention of the indie pop genre is the use of close-ups and this is what the shot represents. The opening shot begins with an extreme close-up of the artists. This is also similar to Leanne Le Havis's opening of Lost and Found. In this shot, when the artist moves her head, the camera also does the same. This makes the audience feel like they are in the video. In this shot, the background is quite dark, but the stars in her face are illuminated. This reinforces the name and the theme of the song. This shot re represents the mise-en-scene because we can see her outfit which is very unique and stands out as a key indie pop genre convention. And we can also see the dancers and the setting, and the setting both of which are unique and should not work together, but do, again emphasising the indie pop genre. Leanne Havis's video, Lost and Found, also makes good use of the conventional close-up. This emphasises the genre.